I'm really thinking about coming back to my career mode. I think I'm having way too much fun. This ankle breaker pretty much says everything that needs to be said about my build. <laughs> Cause you need help. Cause I know that's what people are saying before them ankles buckle. Let me know in the comment section if I should make that return to my career mode. It'll be fun. Yeah, shake down, go get him. The way he break down your team, it's like the stiff as a board and got no rhythm. Your shots got no lift in it. Get blocked like an Olympic flip. Cross you out your socks on some ninja shit. Ankle bully, crossover, breaking your ankles fully. Licking is popping, it's funny. You got the What up? Just wanted to give you guys an update on my new build. This is my 6'7 scoring machine. And you guys know I've been having way too much fun with this build. This build was designed to replace my point guard, my initial build. They're almost built exactly the same in terms of height and weight and everything, but but that original build just couldn't have a steal rating. And you guys know how much I value defense. Speaking of defense, I know this is core conqueror, so the AI is not playing any good defense. Just gonna let me take deep fadeaways whenever. But also, hey, if you guys need a partner for core conqueror, I'm definitely down to play. Just hit me up whenever that event's going on. I'm on Xbox. I will be on PlayStation a little more soon. As soon as I get this build to 99 overall, this is definitely my replacement build. <laughs> but obviously, the AI stands literally no chance. Especially out here when it's threes. It's way too much space. <laughs> and they just don't recover fast enough. And my jump shot is just greening all day nowadays, man. This is me at 92 overall. Just wanted to make sure you guys understand that. If you haven't seen my jump shot video, go back and check it out. It's, it's on the channel. Here's another game where we did an event. I think some people lagged out of this one too. And once again, I'm wide open. If you're, if you're playing against the AI, you gotta expose him and take some threes. I'm trying to drive to the, to the paint on the AI is a waste of time. Just kill him. He ain't playing defense anyway. Some of you guys actually have friends that play like bots. No defense out on the perimeter, having ass. <laughs> Good shot, game over. On to some real gameplay. Is it maxed out or no? No. Well, actually, I shouldn't say it's trash because it's it's almost max. It's like, speaking of defense, a lot of people have been complaining about defense being trash in 2K21 next gen. And that's part of the reason why I made a build that has way more defense. A lot of times I feel just like you guys feel like my players in quicksand at times and it feels like you just can't have that same burst of speed that you have on offense on defense maybe they need to have some kind of quick first step alternative on defense as my prodigy try to hit a bird off the sky with the ball right there what do you guys think i mean i don't know maybe how is it that defense is going to stay with offense without quick first step it, there's got to be some kind of counter on defense eventually but I, I don't want to sound like one of those YouTubers that's just complaining and ruining the game and, you know, begging for things that shouldn't be in the game. I obviously don't want that. You guys remember 2K19, there was some incredible defense being played by the AI back then. And same thing, you know, with guys that were picking all these lockdowns that could shoot threes. As I step back, knock down the game winner. Guess you got to be careful what you wish for. Hey, shout out to all you guys that have been showing up to the park every time I'm out there trying to get some games in, whether you play with me or against me. It's all love, it's all fun. In this case, my man Lunchable, shout out to him. He brought some not so good dudes with him this time. They definitely were not playing defense. You can't just leave somebody who is a shooter at this point wide open. I haven't always been a shooter, so maybe that's maybe that's part of the problem. <laughs> Pulling up from near half court. But this was a really fun game. Obviously, we were just messing around a lot, considering how these guys were not playing defense. And my man Lunchable, don't get too close. <laughs> and I didn't green it for some dumbass reason, but, but hey. He made it. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. So now the score is 19 to two, and all we're trying to do is hit some long range, fade away from half court or a full court shot to end the game. Acting real silly. Definitely just trying to get cold. Wanted to end the game with something spectacular. Like an ankle breaker full court shot or something. 
We're over here taking all the worst shots possible. Are you ready to shoot these? And now I'm cold because of it. Still ain't making that. I'm done. <laughs> the score is 19 to 2, so we're trying to shoot the craziest shot. And this is what happens when you play around too much. Oh no. shit! Uh-oh. I get body. <laughs> he got me back. Cold or not, I am not going out like that. Somebody's gotta pay. Oh, yeah. <sighs> A little payback. Lunchable. Yo, what's up, man? You know you're not allowed to dunk on me, right? Hey, man, I had, you know I had to get that revenge. You broke my ankles, man. You were supposed to go home sad. You were not supposed to go <laughs> home dunking on me. You're getting this little man in trouble. What's going on with you? <laughs> His mom said, who are you talking to? <laughs> your hands will be so stiff. Lately, my game has been glitching so much. I'm going to have to do a video about it tomorrow. I've been seeing foul corruptions. And I'm I'm playing it off like I'm not nervous about it. But every time I see my files are corrupted, I'm thinking, oh man, is this gonna be the time I'ma lose my build? After all this work I've been putting in? And it's crazy, and I always have to unplug my, my Xbox Series X just to fix it. Don't leave me open, kid! Anytime we're playing an event, somebody lags out and we have to back out and regroup or something like that. That person's getting file corrupted. I'm, I know all you guys are experiencing this too, especially on Xbox. I don't know exactly how it's been on PlayStation lately, but I'm going to find out. I'm pretty sure it's the same. And we're definitely reaching out to the devs about this. And it's scary because if you get another patch, sometimes... Sometimes they just make the game worse. I don't know where you're going. Don't get me wrong, the game is running smoother without all that choppiness that we saw when the game first came out. But it's still a big problem. Like, it's still a problem with the file corruptions. Look at this guy. What are you jumping for? <laughs> Let me get this little layup real quick. <laughs> I, don't, I don't even think that's in my layup package. I got LeBron James layup package. He should have died. He should have died right there when he, when he stands back. <laughs> he should have. I just hate that cheese. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, listen, I don't, you're not going to get a GG's back from me. He sent me a GG's, but you're not going to get a GG's from me or any any response from me if you use the curry slide four or five times in one in one setting. Like, the curry slide pandemic continues. Don't get me wrong. I use it every now and then sparingly, but you guys haven't really seen me use it much at all in this video. But I do use it. I try to use it from time to time, you know, as a combo. Not necessarily to get myself open. Because it's obviously the biggest exploit in the game in terms of getting yourself wide open. You, your whole body's going one way and then it just jerks your body into a different direction. And if you time your jump shot right, you can almost hit it every time. There's some people who just abuse using it. That's all I'm saying is just try not to abuse it. But I know people can't help it because it's such a great tool. This was a game where we were playing against this team who they felt like they had to use it almost every possession as well. Except for when my buddy's getting dunked on. But it, it just it just reduces the need to play basketball. Like, if you get that, look how open he gets himself. Especially when he got behind the three-point line. Just by, by using it like two or three times in one possession, you would think it would take a lot of stamina. And I don't want to be hypocritical because there are times where I use it a lot as well, but just not in every single case to get myself open. Maybe I should use it every time. Maybe I'll get open even more. <laughs> nah, I just can't bring myself to doing it. But that's just the way 2K is. Every year there's always some offensive exploit. Whether it's a curry slide or dribbling behind screens. As my man Prodigy lags out of this game, this close competitive game. That man needs some new internet. We'll figure it out regardless. Look, I thought he was gonna use the curry slide right there. Speed boost, gets wide open, knocks down the tying jumper. Now it's up to me to activate the little takeover I got. No curry slide needed. Let's get these guys out of here. Yes, sir. Get him out of here. That'll be the game. It's your boy Shake. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. 
3,000 likes and I'll share my dribble cigs if you guys really want them. It's your boy Shake. I'll holler at you dudes later. A four drawer like a four four or a court you off guard like D Wade. My heat been saved. My ball like Egyptian real estate. Real fake. Who chooses it all? I'm watching Scott to see which mutants will fall. Every line is 3D. Tell a rapper see me. I'm like Kobe on the wing, daring you to D me. From the palace to the bricks, this is marvelous shit, New Jersey. Every time I float, you hear a new words. 32 bars. So shout out to the Shake Squad. Nobody gang stand up.